I, I know what trauma feels like in the body. I know what anxiety feels like in the body. I know what being a teacher feels like every day. I know having too much to do. And I did not have the opportunity you are being given to learn tools now. I had to learn the tools after I got sick. So what you think and feel is directly reflected in not only your heart rate, but your rhythm, the rhythm of your heart. And that's what these little, this little device I'm wearing, I got the brand new one, the fancy one. Um, that's what it's reading. It's telling you in real time what's going on with your heart rhythm. And then your heart rhythm, if you can get that under control through changing thoughts, changing emotions, and changing your breath, three steps. If you do all three of those, then you're not only changing your mental and emotional health and your brain, you are changing your blood pressure. You're changing your hormonal health. You're improving your immune system. You're improving, you know, they're like, it's it's called syncing up. You're syncing up all the systems in your body. Something I thought was interesting when you talked about that husband and wife study they did with his heart rate and how after that argument they got into like his heart rate didn't go back down to what it was before the argument for like such a long time and it's like how one little argument of your day could take such an impact on your heart and for such a long period of time because you think once you've calmed down after the argument it would just go back but it didn't it was like a while before it did I thought that was kind of interesting that's, something I that's know. huge Taylor because that means eight hours after you had a little tiff, maybe with your cooperating teacher or kids got you upset, your heart rate, your cortisol, it's all still pumping in your body. So that's what's affecting your sleep at night. So you've got to have techniques to come down off of that pretty quickly, because if you don't, you're, you know, you're not going to sleep well the next night, your digestive system's going to be off. And then it's just, it's kind of cyclical. Okay, then I don't sleep well, and I'm tired when I go to work the next day. When you're tired, things seem worse than you. You know, it, it, so you have these strategies are how to shift in the moment during the school day, before school, during the school day, when you're done the school day, and maybe before you go to sleep at night.